Hi, this is Piotr Garley and this is a short video on how to use a new PowerPoint feature lock. My primary focus in everything I do is simplicity. So let's make this simple. Let's imagine you want to place a rectangle here in the top right corner. And you want it to be just here and not to be moved accidentally. So how can you lock it? Well, previously the only option was to place it in the Slide Master. You go to the View tab, click Slide Master and here you can place the object. Once you go to the normal view mode, you can select the proper slide with the object and use it without the risk that you'll change its position. The rectangle is uneditable. But now in the newest version of PowerPoint, you can do it much easier. You just place the object, right click on it and choose lock option. And it's locked. Very simple, right? You can lock and unlock in the same manner, just by right clicking. What can you lock on a slide? Pretty much everything. A picture, an icon, a text box, etc. And the best thing about locking a text box is that the text will be editable, but you won't be able to move the box accidentally. So it will always stay in that very position. OK, so you right click on the object, but you don't see that option in your PowerPoint. Let's fix it. First of all, you have to make sure you have the proper version of your PowerPoint. So go to File, Account, and here Check what version you have. If you have any other than Microsoft 365, then you won't be able to have lock option. But if you have exactly this version and still don't see a lock feature, then it means you need to make your PowerPoint updated. How to do it? Very simple. Here in the account section, just expand update options and choose update now. After a restart, you should see the lock option in your menu after right-clicking on any object. How did you like this feature? Give me some feedback and let's stay in touch. And if you want to improve your presentation skills further, you can try my free training on PowerPoint tips and tricks. You will find the link in the description below this video. Thank you for watching and see you soon.